New video captures a mother's point of view as a monster truck takes out live electrical wires and utility poles. And I could hear my son crying and I couldn't get to him. So it was like the worst feeling. Her husband Brian is seen here holding their son Easton as wires fall on top of them. In the video, you see him pulling the wires off of them and moving. He, he did everything he could and more if you ask me. Video taken by another bystander shows ambulances arriving. Jenna Lindsay says earlier in the afternoon, her boyfriend noticed the low hanging wire, so they moved to the opposite end of the stands. So no, I don't like to place fault or blame, but I think that people need to take more time when planning these events and really looking at the what could happen. I'm not, you know what I mean? Because nobody wants this stuff to happen. According to Thompson Police, several people were treated for minor injuries on scene. Two were taken to hospitals. Kayla says a piece of utility equipment fell directly on top of one man. It just took him down like a ton of bricks and he didn't even see it coming. It, it, it was awful. And then, of course, there's live wires, so people can't do anything yet. And he's just he was calling for help. Kayla calls it a freak accident and has no interest in assigning blame, adding that her family hopes the driver of the truck is OK. And other than some soreness, Easton is all right. She says likely to watch monster trucks only on TV, at least for a little while. Um, but other than that, we were completely unscathed. We had nothing. We, it was a miracle. It really was.